Hi, I'm Steve Fulgoni, and we're here today at the shop at the wood turning store and we're going to get another part to our series of quick tips on wood turning and what we're going to do today is we have a walnut bowl blank which has been rough turned at some point um, and we are going to now show uh, the steps to continue to rough this down into a bowl shape so that um, soon after that we will then put a foot on so that the bottom of the bowl can be grabbed in a set of dovetail jaws. Okay, so the tool that we're going to use today is a Hurricane CPM 10V 5 8 inch bowl gouge. The tool is ground with a 65 degree front angle here and about three quarters of an inch swept back wings. And what that is going to do for us is enable us to rough this bowl down very, very easily. Now, um, one of the temptations when you're roughing down a bowl is to set the tool rest out here, like this, and take your gouge, come in this way, and that creates a bit of a problem. Because as you can see, as the bowl is spinning around, you're catching end grain right into the tip of the tool which tends to make it very unpleasant and uncomfortable because every time it comes around you are getting shocked with the tool being pushed back at you so you find yourself having to hold on for dear life and it's just not a lot of fun so we're going to use this tool here we're going to set our tool rest at about 45 degrees or so just about, it's not that critical, to the corner of the bowl. I'm going to take the tool, turn it over on its side like this, and use this section here, the lower wing, it's really acting as a scraper at that point, and knock off these corners, and come around, and around, and around, and around. It's not going to give us a good finish, because it is a scrape but it's going to make it very, very easy to do and quick to do and the force is going to go down into the tool rest as opposed to back out at me. So let's put on my glasses here and let's show you how that's done. We'll start up the lathe. Nice thing about this Robust is you can really get some speed into it. Okay, so here we go. Take a look at what we have. Okay, so the surface is starting to take shape here. Again, it's a rough surface. Let's bring the tool rest in a little bit closer. Trying to do the whole thing in a single pass there. Okay, just the tool rest again. Although it is going to get harder to do it in a single pass with this straight tool rest. Stop there. Take a look. Okay, and you can see tear out. It's nowhere near a good finished surface, but it was very, very easy. Took me just a minute or two. Now what I'll do here is I'll level off the surface.
Okay, so that was a quick and easy way to take that uh, bowl blank, true it up, make it nice and round, and uh, in our next video, we'll take this and we'll put a tenon on it to show you how uh, just to do that, to make a tenon, which we can then mount into dovetail jaws in our uh, scroll chuck. Okay, thanks for watching. I'm Steve Fulgoni.